Hi everyone, I wanted to show you today how I turned a grayscale piece that I drew in Procreate into a colour piece. Um, first of all what I did is sketched it how I would normally sketch it on my um, iPad. I tend to use this technique where it's kind of hatching and stuff when I'm drawing in my sketchbook in tr traditional media like using pencil um, and I find it's just the technique that works best for me. And what I did is drew the piece um, in Procreate and just refined it um, to get it all nice and smooth. And I wanted to create like a sort of quite painterly look to it. I didn't want it to look just like a sketch or just like a digital sketch. I wanted it to look a little bit more like a painting. So what I did is I applied the areas of colour that I needed and then use the smudge tool to blend everything together, like all the edges. Um, and smooth everything out and what I did is I used on the smudge tool I used the um, dry acrylic brush setting or dry acrylic paint it's whichever one it's called um, and then what I did is I used I applied the areas of color like the um, the shades the highlights and like the dark grays and everything and then used the smudge tool to blend everything as you can see here I'm starting to blend everything and make it all nice and smooth and just to get all those colours to mix together um, and just create that sort of painterly look that I wanted. And what I did is I carried on refining the sketch. I wanted to make that eye really pop. Um, and I decided to add a mask to the bottom of the face. I wanted it to sort of be um, someone who's concealing their identity, someone who's hiding from the world. Um, it's just some idea that, that was in my head that I wanted to get down. Then, after sort of refining the mask a little bit and being happy with how it looked, um, I decided to add some colour. And what I did is I started a new layer and then I just filled that layer with some brown and then what I did is reduce the opacity. So it's like a sort of transparent wash of colour over the top of the grayscale image. I've seen quite a few people do this on YouTube and I wanted to give it a go. Um, Normally I'd just work straight in colour if I want to do a colour piece, but it was quite interesting to work in grayscale and then change it into a colour piece. And then what I did on that semi-transparent layer, I added darker and darker shades of brown and highlights and things. And I also added blue to the mask, um, which created this colour layer over the top and turned it into a colour piece. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. If you want more tutorials on this, let me know. I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.